Well, the world's opening back up, which means we're gonna see some live music again. Please. <laughs> if that stays true, then uh, if you're like me and you like to travel around, record music, or if you're doing different sessions on the go or live performances, um, then you will love to have different utilitarian boxes to make sure that things go off without a hitch. And today I wanna to share with you a couple of ones that I've found that can do just that at a killer price point. Let's check it out. Before we jump in, please like this video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, and turn on notifications for more videos from Digital DJ Gear. Hey, what's up guys? This is Dave from Digital DJ Gear here. And today I wanna to talk to you about the new MDB series from Mackie, which is a set of utilitarian boxes that range from DI boxes and also a DAC or DAC converter as well. Um, there's four boxes in the range. There is going to be the MDB 2P, which I have here with me today, and also the MDB USB, which is um, here as well. And then they also have two other boxes, the MDB 1A, which is a one channel active DI box, and the MDB 1P, which is a one channel passive DI box. Um, both of these that I have with me today are phenomenal. Um, they are priced really, really well, so let's get into it. So the first box I wanna start off with and take a look at is gonna be the MDB2P, which is a stereo passive DI box. Um, if you are new to recording or a new instrumentalist and you're not quite sure what a DI box is or why you should have one, um, essentially DI boxes were developed to fix any um, impedance mismatch issues. So essentially the, D, uh, the actual DI box itself will take the high impedance unbalanced signal of say a guitar or a bass and convert that to a lower impedance balanced signal that can be connected to a mic preamp or to a board. So um, another uh, really good uh, feature set or reason why to have a DI is to um, fix any kind of ground loop issues, hum or buzz, which most likely you'll see is the reason why a lot of those are used today. Um, because of like, unless you have vintage gear, but but otherwise than that, you know, most times most guitarists or bassists are dealing with ground looping issues. So the MDB 2P comes in at $79.99, great, great value for the price. Um, rugged metal chassis, um, you do have a dual pair, so stereo pair of ends. You also have a stereo through set and also stereo out, um, obviously, the through is good for, you know, if you're gonna play guitar, have that unaffected signal, then go to like your amp, and then have the actual affected signal um, go out to, let's say for example, the main house board, that sort of stuff. Um, you do have pads, so if your guitar has hotter, you know, pickups on it, you can pad the signal. It's a 50, 15 dB pad on this guy. And there's also a ground lift on it as well, which will allow you to, you know, um, eliminate ground loops by lifting the ground. Um, this guy here, throw it in your bag. It could be a great main DI box. Um, since DIs do come in a vast array of feature sets and price points, um, some uh, more experienced or even newer guitarists may have a preferred box they use, but having a backup never hurts. And this guy here is a great, great value, a great, great addition to your arsenal at $79.99. Definitely recommend it if you don't have one already. The next um, unit I have here from the MDB series is gonna be the MDB USB, which is a stereo DAC or digital to analog converter. This guy here is coming in at $169.99. So it is priced like an interface because obviously um, when it comes to having an actual DAC in it, you will do some conversions. Um, essentially, it's gonna be a class compliant for Windows and Mac um, USB device. So connects to your computer via USB. Um, it allows you to basically convert the digital signal coming from your computer via USB to an analog signal to be monitored via headphone out or speaker monitors using the left and right outputs. You actually are able to connect regular headphones. There's a 3.5 millimeter connection on that for the headphone out, so no need for an adapter. Um, you do have an actual mono switch to be able to monitor your signal in mono. And I love the fact that the pot is granular. So it's not a stepped encoder, but you can feel each individual slot um, when you turn it up and down, which is nice. So when you set it, you don't have to worry about having to adjust it once it's to your liking, which is really good. And again, this guy also has a ground lift switch on it as well, in case you're having any kind of issues with um, power or any kind of like, you know, just in general ground looping issues. 
Um, and again, this is gonna be a really good box to have on the go when you're out there doing your uh, recordings or if you are um, in need of having a backup DI or a backup DAC to monitor things, um, this guy will do the trick for you as far as monitoring the stereo pair. You just plug it into your Mac or your PC, select it in your actual DAW, no drivers are needed installed, and then you're good to go. Okay, cool. Now those are the two utilitarian boxes from Mackie in the MDB series that I have with me today. And as I mentioned before, they do have the MDB-1A, which is the one channel active DI. That guy is coming in at $79.99. And then there's also the MDB-1P, which is the one channel passive DI. And that guy comes in at $69.99. And again, these are just gonna to be tools to add to your arsenal. They're good to have, especially if you're dealing with guitarists or bassists, whether recording or if you're playing. And if you do have a DI box, which is your favorite, but it's always good to have a backup, then these are priced at the place where you can have these, throw these in your bag, they travel well, no need to worry about breaking them, the chassis are phenomenal, and I think that these are really good to add to your arsenal. Thank you guys for watching again. Um, and as always, be kind to each other and stay focused. Peace. We hope you enjoyed this video from Digital DJ Gear. To learn more about all of our pro audio, lighting, DJ, and recording equipment, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel now. Be sure to leave a comment below if this video helped you and check out these other videos we think you might like. Until next time, thanks for watching.